arriving on screens on Friday, the 2nd of February. Requiem is the BBC's latest psychological thriller and trust us when we say this, it doesn't disappoint. The story begins with Matilda Grey, a rising star in the classical music world, whose mother suddenly ends her life with no explanation. In the episodes that follow, Matilda embarks on a journey of discovery, encountering seemingly supernatural events along the way. The cast boasts a number of familiar names and Lydia Wilson takes on the lead role, but this is far from her first huge project, and following her outstanding performance, we highly doubt that this will be her last either. Get to know Lydia, with our 9 facts in 90 seconds, her film debut was back in 2010. Lydia's silver screen debut came courtesy of a small row in Never Let Me Go, the dystopian drama based on Kazuo Ishiguro's novel. Kira Knightley, Carey Mulligan and Andrew Garfield were the film's stars and having been well received by critics, Never Let Me Go went on to garner multiple award nominations. And Lydia is no stranger to TV dramas you might recognize her from, Ripper Street thanks to her star turn as Mimi Morton, Misfits, or, the National Anthem episode of Black Mirror. Lydia's recent work also includes the film, Star Trek, Beyond. She's a huge Joni Mitchell fan Lydia once said she'd love to play a character imagined by singer Joni Mitchell. Quote, I think Blue is the perfect, perfect, perfect album, she told what's on stage. The character she'd come up with for me would probably be a boy from the other side of the world. She's pretty patient playing Kalara and Star Trek Beyond required four hours in the makeup chair every single day. Rather her than us, to be honest. She trained at Rada Lydia graduated from the Royal Academy of Dramatic Art in 2009 and prior to that, studied English literature at Cambridge. She once played Kate Middleton Lydia starred in the 2014 stage production, King Charles III, which imagined what the world might be like when the Queen's son ascends to the throne. It was here that she was spotted by a Star Trek casting director. Trying to emulate her and walk in her shoes quite literally has been a bit of a growing up experience, she previously said. I've become a lady. Her other stage roles have include Annabella in Tis Pity She's a Whore and Kate in the Olivier Award-winning Blast. She received seriously random texts from Bill Nye while speaking to Interview magazine. Lydia previously revealed her friendship with the Love Actually star. Explaining how he once inadvertently cheered her up on a tough day, she said, I remember I got home and I had this message from Bill Nye, who sends me pictures of the ocean randomly, about once a year. He sent me this beautiful movie of the ocean he made. There were no words. Of all the days to get this lovely message from this planet it was good timing on his part. It wasn't negative, it was eye-opening. Requiem airs on BBC One at 9pm, Friday the 2nd of February. The whole series will then be available to watch on the BBC iPlayer. Rachel McGrath Entertainment Reporter